You've always been told that the square root of a negative number is impossible, but we can actually solve them using imaginary numbers. So they're normally impossible because you can't multiply two of the same number to get a negative number. Like for example, if we had four times four, we would get 16. But if we had negative four times negative four, we would still have positive 16 because two negatives make a positive. But negative square roots come up all the time in real life problems. So because of that, we need to give a special letter to negative square roots. So we've given the square root of negative one, the letter I, but this is the square root of negative 16. So how can we get I out of this? Well, two square roots multiplied together multiply the insides. So we can just do the opposite of that and split this up and do the square root of negative one times the square root of 16. And as we said before, the square root of negative one is i. And the square root of 16, well, that's a real number. Four times four is 16, so the square root of 16 is four. And now to just keep this neater, we'll put the number before the letter. And our final answer is four i. That is the square root of negative 16.